Hi, in this video, it is all about the pixels. Yay! Are you ready to learn about pixels? I know I'm ready to teach you. So let's get into your ads manager. This is my ads manager, and I want to show you where you can find your pixels. So up here in the upper left-hand corner, this is how the new ads manager looks, just an FYI, as of right now. Um, who knows what other changes are going to be coming into place. So then you want to come into the pixels, which mine's under frequently used just because I go in there a lot. Um, normally it'll be under the assets. So let's click on pixels. And by February 17th, everybody's going to be switched over to the new pixel. And the new pixel, what's really cool about it is that you put this one piece of code on your website and you're able to create custom conversions, which means you won't even need to put the code on your website anymore, which is fantastic. So, well, on the different web pages, the main code needs to go in the header of your page of your um, website. So let's take a peek seat. So what I'm going to do is show you what you'll do. If you haven't created it yet, what it'll say, what will pop up here is to create your first pixel. It'll be a green or blue button. You'll click create it. Um, I left mine as the default pixel. You can name it, um, for example, Shay's website pixel. And that's just what the main name is going to be. Once you create it, it'll say view the pixel code. So then I'm going to come in here and I'm going to click on actions and I'm going to click on view pixel code. So this is the pixel base code. This is the main code. It goes in the header um, of your main website. It'll track visitors to your web page. It's going to be able to track conversions for you, website clicks, um, checkouts, like it's going to just, um, it's going to track the whole shebang. So then what you'll want to do is you'll want to copy this, copy and paste, and then you'll click done. And I use WordPress. I use the Divi theme through Elegant Themes. It is fabulous. So then what you'll want to do is you'll want to come to your um, WordPress site. If you have Squarespace, you will be able to put it in the header code under settings and you'll be able to use it that way. So then what you'll want to do after that, when you're on to your website, as you can see, I'm on shayrubsky.com. I'm in my back office. I come down to the Divi theme and then I come into my theme options. Um, I'm gonna leave this, I didn't make any changes. So then when I get to my theme options, what's going to happen is it's going to have different um, things for me to click on. I'm gonna go to integration, and then you'll see it automatically has it, add code to the head of your blog. And as you can see, my code is already installed, so you just copy and paste that code inside of here. You'd want to scroll down, click save, and then you're able to do it. Most newer themes have this option. If they do not, um, definitely ask your uh, website developer. If you have a website developer, they can help you find it or add it for you. And you'll be able to get that added. So that's how you add the main pixel to your website. It goes into the header of your blog or your website. Let me know if you have any questions.